नमस्कार दोस्तों मैं अमोनिरुद आप सभी का सिविल गुरु जी और स्वैग से स्वागत है आप सभी का मेरे चैनल में आई होप ऑल ऑफ यू आर सेफ सो गेट 2022 ट्वेंटी टू इज नॉकिंग ऑन द डोर एंड न्यू टाइप ऑफ क्वेश्चन जो कि एक्चुअली पिछले बार इंट्रोड्यूस हुआ था विच इज इंट्रोड्यूस इन द प्रीवियस ईयर बट एक्चुअली उससे क्वेश्चन काफी ज्यादा नहीं आया था इन सम ब्रांचेस लिस्ट लाइक सिविल दैट इज योर एम एस क्यू पैन ऑफ क्वेश्चन एंड डेफिनेटली इस बार तो वो उससे क्वेश्चन देने वाले हैं तो एटलीस्ट यू नो फाइव टू सिक्स क्वेश्चन और अकॉर्डिंग टू देम सेवन टू एट परसेंट ऑफ द टोटल मार्क्स विल बी फ्रॉम योर एम एस क्यू सेवन टू एट परसेंट ऑफ द क्वेश्चन तो सर ये होना चाहिए एटलीस्ट राइट फ्रॉम योर एम एस क्यू पैटर्न इस बार भी अगर नहीं देंगे तब तो यार बहुत ज्यादा गाली खाने वाले वो लोग पिछले बार खा चुके थे वो लोग सो लेट सी वॉट हैपन्स बट वी हैव टू बी रेडी टू फेस देम बेसिकली सो हाउ टू tackle this msq type of questions let's have a look so firstly two things i would like to say firstly if it's a numerical you know uh, type of question actually numerical mein msq aane ke chances thoda kam hai frankly speaking uh if actually it comes If actually it comes actually, तो वो किस तरह के क्वेश्चन आ सकते हैं वो भी मैं बता रहा हूं मेनली इट कैन कम फ्रॉम द क्वेश्चन एक्चुअली प्रीवियस टू प्रीवियस ईयर एक्चुअली नो टू 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 मार्क्स क्वेश्चन और उससे भी पहले फाइव मार्क्स के जो क्वेश्चन थे बहुत दिन पहले आता था इफ यू आर वॉचिंग मल्टीपल स्टेप्स इन दो क्वेश्चन एक्चुअली बहुत सारे स्टेप्स है मल्टीपल स्टेप्स एक्चुअली इफ यू आर यू नो हैविंग इन दैट क्वेश्चन देन वॉट इज हैपनिंग देर इज अ पॉसिबिलिटी दैट दैट क्वेश्चन might come right so multiple steps are there teen char steps hai suppose then you are finally reaching the answer okay or say multiple things can be asked from that question for example soil soil mechanics a property of question please stay tuned to the end of this video i'm just going to show you the trick actually for msq questions थ्रू अ पर्टिकुलर क्वेश्चन मैं वहां से भी कुछ आपको चीजें बताऊंगा फॉर थियोरिटिकल क्वेश्चन हाउ टू हैंडल If you don't know the answer, okay. If you know the answer, then तो सर हो ही गया कोई दिक्कत नहीं है So basically, suppose what happens that uh, soil mechanics type of questions actually say uh, properties of soil. Different properties are existing, right? So some data are given. Then suppose porosity, void ratio, air content, degree of friction. All these things are given actually. So four options can be easily made from that. Okay. But suppose it's a theoretical question and the question is suppose something like this then how to do it so i have also told it earlier a lot of ways but still i am uh, telling it to be many people because bahut sare log puchte hain ye isliye firstly if it's i would say a pure informative type of statements actually matlab information as if right um so mainly in 80% of the cases again that is found to be correct if it's a total information based question sirf information sa usme right for example the first statement hydrometer is used for testing the quality of milk something like that so it's pretty pretty very you know like information based questions i would say okay after that suppose it comes readings on the neck of the hydrometer increases up the scale always you know this particular thing now actually the answer is you know decreases uh the scale of the scale always but niche is so you know whenever there is a chance of opposing things matlab increase hai to definitely decrease hone ka bhi chance hai wahan pe thoda shak karna at least you know matlab just do your focus actually on that particular portion that you know it may be sometimes increase or decrease bhi ho sakta hai right and also in some of the cases just like the third statement temperature correction always remains positive so if there is very much obvious any particular statement is very obvious it is always positive it is it cannot ever be done never ever it is possible something like that right so always there just take it that up with a pinch of salt right i mean in most of the cases 70% of the cases those statements are found to be wrong most of the cases i would say right okay last question last uh, suppose you know 2 and 3 are wrong right you have found out in that fashion actually increases decreases ho sakta hai and your temperature correction always remains positive always wahan se ho sakta hai and first one is informative so that is correct so one is correct but you have found from your intuition and using this tricks that two and three are wrong now c actually four is one of the things right so if it's an msq question so most of the times the chances that 
two options will be correct at least more than one option will be correct so one and four suppose so like a and d are correct something like that right so in this fashion you can do Achha. in some other type of questions actually suppose one statement is uh, you know given that is a definition okay of say specific yield you know specific yield and specific retention these two terms are there and they are very much correlated to each other just like one is the complementary term of the other right something like that so basically suppose the definition of this aap bol rahe the na ki sir information informative hoga tabhi correct hoga always kahan pe wahan pe shak karna main bata raha hu suppose you know two very much complementary terms are there specific yield specific retention definition of one term is given sir this 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 okay the amount of water that can be you know held against the gravity is known as specific yield okay per unit volume so you are saying it's a definition right but actually it's the not the definition of specific it is the definition of specific retention right so this type of cases actually can happen when there are two very complementary terms actually suppose jo ki bahut aas paas hai ek dusre ki right uh, wahan pe aise cheeze ho sakta hai for example porosity void ratio right suppose one statement is given that porosity is given as the volume of voids by volume of solids to thoda sa shak karna wahan pe because the actual definition it is actually the definition of void ratio volume of void by volume of solid on the other hand volume of void by total volume is the definition of porosity so yahan pe definition hote hue bhi aap thoda shak karna so basically at least you know you have to you know these are all the tricks when at least you know something right and uh, in most of the cases that actually leads to mistakes right but if you suppose don't know anything regarding any of the statements a b c and d so please don't try to attempt that attempt kar lena but uh, because since it's not esc prelims it's gate and in gate msq questions actually uh, does not carry any uh, negative marking so please try to attempt all the msq and nt questions this is my humble request to all of you both so These are some of the tricks that you can definitely use to solve the MSQ question. That's all for today. Thank you. Bye bye. Take care. Definitely do subscribe to my channel for daily such informative contents. Bye bye. Take care. This is Anirudh signing off. Do subscribe to my channel and do join my Gate uh, Telegram channel for daily Gate quizzes, which are absolutely free to attend. Bye.